What's going with y'all? It's your boy Slop Bucket back in this bitch. And today in a new video. In this video, we're gonna be talking about this Daniel Con Cone bullshit that I saw, bro. You see, this bitty Daniel Cohn, nobody knows exactly who what her exact age is. <laughs> I can't even cap. Like, people say she's 12, people say she's 13, 14, 15, but nobody actually knows, like, what her actual age is, you know what I'm saying? Because she caps her ass off, instead of keeping it 100%, she gotta cap her ass off and be like, oh, I'm not 12, oh, I'm 16. No, you're not. She don't even look 16 at all, my nigga. But this girl literally... Was having sex at like 14 years old. And got pregnant, bro. First of all, the dudes that's dating her are low-key weirdos. First of all, because she's young as hell. And these niggas that be dating her be like three years older than her. You know what I'm saying? Like, nah, bro, that shit is weird. How do niggas do that, bro? How do niggas do that? Date bitches that's three years younger than them. When they in high school too. It's not like they in college or some shit. They in high school. That's like the same thing as a freshman dating a senior. Borderline weird as fuck. Borderline pedophilia. <laughs> Borderline pedophile shit, my nigga. Like, like what the fuck, bro? And her mom continues to let this shit slide bro that's the problem and the father he tried to even get custody of her but if you know you know how family court goes they never give the father their fucking kids it's only a rare of occurrence where they'll give the father their kids like if the mom is a complete drug addict or some shit and can't take care of kids then that's when they give the kids. But other than that, they don't give the kids. And that's the situation that Daniel Cohn's dad is in right now. Yo, the thing is, too, if Daniel Cohn was with her father this whole time, to be honest with y'all, nigga, she would even have a career, most likely. Most likely, she probably wouldn't even have a career like how she has right now. So her mom did let her get into certain opportunities but it's, it's not good for her bro because she got pregnant by some nigga that's like 16 years old my nigga or 17 years old my nigga like like what the fuck bro what are you doing as a parent that you letting your kid do that come on bro you ain't you ain't even got the decency to tell the nigga that's fucking your daughter to put on a condom or even tell your daughter to get birth control, bro. Like, come on. Like, her mom is horrible, bro. Her mom's is horrible. And, and her mom's, I don't know if y'all niggas could see it, but I could clearly see it. Her mom's is literally using her for clout and money. That's why that household is so fucked up. The father is like the only sane person part of that family, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, if he was there, shit would be set straight and everything would be chill. Everything would be good. But nah, since the mother controls everything and she's a horrible mother, Daniel Cohn is in the situation she's in now. Having to get a fucking abortion at like 14 years old because some... Older nigga fucked her shit. <laughs> like, I, I, it just amazes me to see how, how these adults think they're so better than teenagers. And so, so much of a role model, but they do stupid shit all the time. All the time. You know what I'm saying? And then, of course, she don't even know, like, half the time what's happening. I could bet you on that shit. Half the time, she don't even know what the fuck is going on. She she most likely doesn't have control over her finances. Most likely, it's her mom's job. You know what I'm saying? And that's where the 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 mom using her 
comes into play. Because the mom's just sitting back and watching her daughter do everything that she does. And enabling her to do all the weird shit that she does. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you're enabling somebody, you're literally contributing to the problem. And her mom's is literally contributing to the problem. It doesn't make sense. Like, what the fuck are you doing? Get the father. I hope the father goes into family court again, bro. Like, for real. And it's like, yo, I want my daughter. My daughter's getting sexually exploited online. I want my daughter right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, like... Imagine being a father and, and your daughter gets taken away from you. And then you on the internet and you randomly see your daughter half naked dancing, bro. And she's like 13. Imagine seeing that as a father. <laughs> oh, hell no. That kid would be mine so fast. It's not even funny. Like, literally, bro. I don't even care if the kid is not even biologically mine. I'm still taking that kid. Like, like no, bro. But, hey. That was just my analysis of that Daniel Cohn situation. Let me know how y'all niggas feel about that shit. You feel me in the comments? I'll catch y'all niggas. Peace of trance.